So, you've done well for yourself. What? What, what are you doing here? Is that how you greet your mother, Trevor? I, I, I didn't know they let you out. So you never wrote to me? You never visited? Well, well I... I bet you never found a girl. Tell me, Trevor, are you gay? No. Is that what this is all about? No. I wouldn't care. In fact, I've always wanted a gay son. A son who wouldn't forget about his mother. But Ma! But Ma, but Ma, but Ma, nothing. Not a peep. I carried you in here. I fed you. I weaned you. Now look at you. You always were an ungrateful, wretched, sniveling sack of shit of a boy. You know it, and I know it. There was always something wrong with you. Ashamed of yourself, ashamed of me, of your own mother. I've been here for hours, and have you gotten me a drink or a cigarette or massaged my feet? I'm an old woman, and you, in the prime of life, have you nothing inside? I'm so sorry. I... <laughs> there, there, it's okay, son. <laughs> oh, that's it now. <laughs> Here I am, old and tired and alone. I'm so sorry for everything. Exactly. For everything. I'm an old woman, Trevor. I don't got no insurance. Oh, I got money! I don't want your goddamn money! Is that what you think I am? A prostitute? Still? You're sick. What should I do? I'm in a lot of pain. I need you to get me some more Deludamol. I can do that. A lot of them. A truckload, literally. And not those weedy little ones. The thousand milligram ones. And if you find me a gentleman, well, we both know you need a father figure. I need a cab, pronto. Stay where you are. I got a driver right around the corner. That'll work. Hey, my man, where you going? Strawberry. Right away, sir. All right, brother, here we are.